Hey guys, Miles here from We Know Tobacco. Um, last video I did was on was the box opening I did, um, and this is some. Um, we do a, most of our filming at David's house, so I kind of have to pack most of my stuff up. And here I have one of my little travel tins of my Erebus. My favorite, the stuff I got like 14 ounces of. <sighs> Anyways. Um, so, and I'm going to do a review video for you now. Okay. I'm going to be smoking my Bennington Church Warden, made in Italy. You know, I like it because it's got a slightly smaller bowl. It's good for, you know, shorter smokes, you know. So what you got today, we got, we got an appearance from the pipe tool. Matches and little simple fold that pipe stand. It's kind of easier to fold the pipe on there. So, so. What do you guys think about the lockout? Not no longer being a lockout. You know, who's your favorite team? Tell me a little about that. I'm personally ashamed to admit a Bengals fan, and we just lost one of our um, better players, to say the least, um, Mr. Chad Ochocinco. If any of you guys have an input on that, feel free to let me know. Um, also, I mean, there's a lot going on now. Literally, the lockout was announced, and I mean, they're just blowing up with news on, oh, we got this guy being signed, we got that guy being signed, you know, and it's just, I mean, it's really blowing up, you know, so... I'm not going to fill it up all the way, but I'm going to fill it up most of the way, you know? Nice, good smoking, you know? We got a mostly full bowl. I don't know if you can see. Here we go. So enjoyable. Okay, so first thing I can tell you, I'm still kind of new to pipe smoking, so um, although I do like some English tobaccos, this is an aromatic blend, and um, one of my favorites. And it's also nice though because as I am new, I gotta be like. Um, tobacco smoker or pipe smoker. A lot of our friends still aren't used to the fact of me, you know, smoking and stuff. And hold on. See a nice even burn there. Anyways, um, no, but the aromatic blends my friends enjoy more, because it's not like, you know, it's pleasant for them, it's not like harsh or takes getting used to, and it leaves a, this leaves a beautiful smell in the air, I mean, I gotta tell you, it's like a, how to describe it? Maybe like a, it's kind of like a sweet smell near. 
It leaves a far sweeter smell than it actually tastes. You know, which is kind of nice about the aromatic blends because you can enjoy it and it doesn't feel like you're sucking on a, like a lollipop or a sucker. But for the other people around you, it's like a nice, mellow smell. Um, but this is actually, you know, staying lit okay. Got a text. Um, you know, and it's just... It burns, like I said, and like I said in the earlier video, it's got a really nice burn to it. And it's got a really consistent burn. That's what I'm trying to say. You know, it stays even, and it's not, it doesn't really actually get, like, I can even puff this, like, pretty fast, and it won't get too hot on me. You know? Kind of been working on my smoke rings, but definitely a pr work in progress. Um. Anyways, um, I think it concludes this review for today. You know, it's a, you know, it's a not too expensive house blend Bennington offers. And uh, if anybody has any questions on ordering it, you know, more questions that I may have missed in this review video, or just wants to know more about Bennington or this tobacco or any other video for that matter. Just comment or send us a personal message and we'll be glad to respond. I'll handle the pipes and David in the other room now will handle cigars. So I think that concludes this video for today guys. Um, subscribe and like our videos and uh, happy smoking.